everybody today we are going to discuss formation of ammonia molecule on the basis of hybridization in ammonia nitrogen is present as a central atom having atomic number 7 whose electronic configuration can be written as 1s2 2s2 2px1 2py1 and 2pz1 so in this case nitrogen do not have any vacant higher energy orbital in the valence shell. Hence, its ground state electronic configuration is considered as excited state electronic configuration and at this state, <coughs> by formation of ammonia molecule, nitrogen undergoes sp3 hybridization by mixing 1 s orbital and 3 p orbitals of the valence shell which lead to the formation of 4 sp3 hybrid orbitals having maximum symmetry. Now, out of 4 hybrid orbitals, one of the hybrid orbitals contain pair of electrons supposed to be this hybrid. The hybrid orbital having pair of electrons remains as a lone pair on nitrogen. Now remaining 3 sp3 hybrid orbitals having unpaired electron undergoes overlap. I mean take part in the bond formation. Now 3 hydrogen atoms along with s orbital having unpaired electron in s orbital in fact overlap with the sp3 hybrid orbitals of nitrogen which lead to the formation of 3 NH bonds and hence ammonia molecule get formed. <coughs> now what happens in case of ammonia nitrogen contains lone pair of electron so according to valence shell electron pair repulsion theory repulsion between lone pair and bond pair of electrons is greater than the repulsion between bond pair and bond pair of electrons due to which bond angle I mean H and H bond angle in ammonia is reduced to 107 degree and its geometry is somewhat distorted. In fact, instead of tetrahedral, it is pyramidal in case of ammonia. Thank you very much.